Ben Askren is back in the spotlight. Um, I really have to give it up for Ben Askren because I think that it's amazing that he's doing this in a way because I feel like most people might have just kind of crawled up and just, you know, go away from the spotlight, hide away. They don't want to hear from the media. They don't want to hear from the naysayers. They don't want to hear from all these haters. Um, you know, because they don't want those, that judgment, you know, of like, you know, because his UFC run, his UFC career was awful. He didn't, in my opinion, he didn't win at all. Like, he didn't win any fights. You know, the Robbie Lawler fight, I mean, everyone can agree that that was, that was BS, you know, um, what Jorge Masvidal did to him, you know, um, and then Maya, you know. So the thing about Ben Askren is, yes, he has so much, like, just accolades, you know, like, his resume is incredible, like, six knockout wins, six submissions, seven decision wins, so it's just like, you know, I get that, but you also have to factor in age, okay, so Ben Askren is 36, Jake Paul is 24, and, you know, Ben Askren, he had his hip surgery, he technically retired, so I'm, I'm kind of, like, confused that he's taking this, you know, um, I think maybe he's taking it for money. I mean, who wouldn't want all of that money, right? But um, the thing is, is that Jake Paul, too. Jake Paul, he has Jorge Masvidal in his corner. He has a lot of momentum. He has, like, this star power, this belief. He's, like, you know, crazy, crazy amount of people behind him and energy behind him and self-belief and, like, followers and subscribers and he's like a rapper and like you could just tell his ego is so big but it's also I think it helps him you know it's like an advantage um and I think he's gonna go in there just so certain that he's just gonna win and the thing too is that I think a lot of us you know just what happened recently with Ben Askren well not recently but you know what happened with in the UFC with Ben Askren um it just seems like he's on his way out, you know? Like, there's no other way to say it. Like, him as an athlete, you know? Um, but, you know, I, I think that Ben Askren, if Ben Askren would win, I mean, I would be really pleased with that. I'd be really happy for him because I feel like it would be kind of like he's redeeming himself, you know? It's like a redemption. And, you know, it's hard to kind of have all of these eyeballs on you, judging you, um, and what happened, you know, with the knockout of Jorge Masvidal, what Jorge Masvidal did to Ben Askren was just like so devastating for him. Um, so like to pick himself back up, just dust himself off, take this boxing match, which you know, I think a lot of us, we think like, at least I do, like he's more, he's more known for his ground game, he's known for his wrestling, um, although he does have six knockout wins on his, you know, on his MMA record. So. He says he's going to beat Jake Paul in the seventh round. Um, I don't know. I don't know how I'm thinking about this, you know, because a part of me is like, no, like, you know, Ben Askren, he's like the real athlete, you know? He, he know, he's been in the game. He's experienced. And Jake Paul is just some, he's just some guy. He's a YouTuber. He's a rapper. He's not serious. He looks the part, but he doesn't really know what he's getting into. And then another part of me is like, Ben Askren is 36 years old, he retired, he had a hip surgery, he got KO'd in such a devastating fashion with Jorge Masvidal, I mean, yeah. So it's like, I don't know, let me know in the comments, I'm gonna have to, if I had to put money on this fight, I would pick Jake Paul. I would pick Jake Paul, like, I would think he's gonna win. Um, but, if Ben Askren pulls this off, I think that's like, you know, I'll definitely applaud because... Yeah, like for him to do that, like especially after after such a low, low, you know, I love watching the underdog just come out there and just make, make stuff happen. So um, yeah, let me know in the comments what you think.